What's up, everybody? Welcome back. This is Forgo. Today, we're going to do a few different things. One thing we're going to do is we're going to be doing some summons because today is the last day for these rubies. These things are going to be gone today, so make sure that you do use these things before they run out. I need Eno's 3 PG card, and that's exactly what we're going to be going for. Now, as far as what my, how my free-to-play account has been doing so far, uh, I've been doing really, really awesome. I thought I'd give you guys an update on this thing. Uh, I've already showed you that I cleared all of this with May. And actually, in the other one here, I've been using Eno, and I'm already at level 46 with my Eno. So I damn near got this done as well. Really would like to have a 3 PG because I believe I could actually get it done probably a 2 star, a level 52 star without even leveling up my fame system. I don't even have this thing leveled up for my green fighters at all. But I might have to do that just to make sure that I can get to level 50 uh, with her in the gear project, which is pretty spectacular. Now, as far as the pulls and the summons... I've gotten pretty lucky with some of the cards. I've already gotten uh, Dizzy's 3PG, I got Ramathal's 3PG, I got May's 3PG, but I don't have Biken's 3PG and I don't have Eno. Now, I need Eno's 3PG because I already have the character, and we all know that, you know, these characters shine a lot more when they have those nice long animations, and Eno's 3PG is a really good 3PG animation. It is fairly long, and it really will help her survivability because she's going to be in an iframe every time you do it. And as far as said cards on my free to play account, I was able to get like uh, four of these cards, but I never did get a type two. So hopefully I can get a type two card and also get Eno's three PG. If by some miracle I get really lucky and get my Eno three PG card early, if I just get the Eno three PG card early, then I'm going to go ahead and not worry about the set cards because you can actually go into the exchange card here. And you can actually make another one of those cards if you really want to. So I could just click on here. And then I could just click on these two extras that I have. I'll still have a full set. And I can actually make me a Type 2 card. So I'm not really too worried about the set cards. Because I can get a set card set no matter what. But I do want Eno's 3PG. And if I do get that damn 3PG early, I'm going to go ahead and start pulling for Dizzy and Ramlethal and their banner because I already have their 3PG cards. Now, a question that was asked me in my previous video is what kind of settings do I run on Moo Moo Play? And I gotta tell you guys that I've been running this thing, like I ran this thing for hours and hours and hours yesterday. It never crashed. It never crashed, not even one time. It ran smooth, I didn't have any problems, it played wonderfully. So I'll go ahead and kind of show you guys what my settings are really quick. Just for those of you that are interested, you can see the basic here, nothing really major, the advanced, right? Speed, direct X, right? I got my performance on custom, uh, CPUs on four right here, and then my memory is on nine. I do use an Acer Predator uh, laptop. It's got a 10th generation i7 CPU in it. It also has a 2070 Max-Q GPU also. But some, some of you were interested in what I run as far as, you know, the settings, and here they are. You can see I got the FPS at 60 right here. You can see the properties right here, nothing really major there. And then the game settings, uh, this is at 120 FPS, but this is really mainly for another game that I can actually play at 120 FPS. Unfortunately, in Copos, you can only play at 60 FPS, but even though I have this on 120, uh, I don't have any problems at all. So those are the settings that I'm running on Moomoo Play. Now let's go ahead and jump into the banner and let's see what we can get. Now, Eno's 3PG, that's what we want. By the way, guys, I've also gotten Saul twice. I've went through this thing twice and I already got him to A1, which is pretty damn lit. So let's do it, man. If I get Eno's 3PG right away, that's going to make me super happy because that means I can take all these rubies and I can go into the banner for Dizzy and Ramlethal and start pulling for them because I already have their 3PGs. That's kind of what I'm hoping for, but I mean, y'all know how luck can go when it comes to uh, playing these things. You just, you just never know, right? Uh, luck can be pretty sh shitty sometimes, and sometimes it can be pretty amazing. We'll just go ahead and skip it. I should have just skipped it anyways. Oh, well. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. And the thing is, you know, I got a good amount of rubies on my free-to-play account, and I actually can get a lot more rubies from the story mode right now, and I can get a few more from the gear project. So, you know, I, I was kind of hoping that if I could get Eno's 3PG early, that I would be able to... Oh, it's nice to have that idle cool card. 
Uh, for all those of you newer players, these this set cards actually very, very good on some characters. In fact, it's number one on some characters, including SS and BS. That's pretty much the best set for BS Leona. And I'm pretty sure it's going to be, and I, I hear it's a really great set for Dizzy as well. All right, so there's a Fest card. Which one is it? Hmm, I'm not sure which type of that one, that one is. So this is a type two card. So I actually have a full set now. Not bad. Got lucky on the set cards. That's pretty awesome. So I'll be able to do a video about that. But uh, we really, really want Eno's 3PG, man. You know, and they're probably going to make me go to pity. I imagine they will, which sucks. But this, you know, during these collaborations, this is the only time that you can get these cards, man. And that's kind of the thing. Ah. We'll just skip it. Pretty sure I didn't get it. We got an option card. Yay, raw. Don't care about that option card. 3PG, 3PG, 3PG. That's all we want. We don't we don't care about that option card. Option card's nice, it is, but I don't care about it. Ooh. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Let's just skip it. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I always kinda look over this just to make sure I don't miss my card here. Yeah, man, we're 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 gonna go to pity. I can see it already. They're gonna make me do this crap. Uh, and I really don't want any more cars. Oh, what we got here? Crap, man! Option card. Come on, man. Give me Eno's three PG. Jesus, what is going on? Dizzy loves me. She loves me. I mean. These are good cars. The increased attack and critical rate. I mean, he's going to add a lot, a lot of CP. The critical damage here, they're going to add a lot of damn CP to your Guilty Gear fighters for sure. But uh, it's not what we want. Son of a gun, man. Son of a gun. I feel like I get teased every time I see that. Hmm. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Yep, skip it. Nothing. Not a bummer. I, I, I think I'm going to be saying bummer a lot. And this really sucks. I'm going to have to do some figuring as far as, you know, whether or not I'll be able to go to the Pity uh, for Dizzy and Ramlethal. If I can go to that Pity, I'll definitely do some more pulls. I'm just going to go ahead and skip it. Look at that. Look at that. 3PG for Dizzy. Again. I wish I could exchange, like, uh, 3PGs for another 3PG. Let me look at something really quick. I'm not really for sure if I can or not. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, that's what I thought. See, I really wish we could do that. That would be dope, but no, 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 no. No, 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 that marble won't, they don't want to do that. Crap. It sucks, right? You can do that with the fest cards, but you can't do it with the three PGs. Hmm. Uh, I'm not really too excited because I'm, you know, I'm already at the pity, so I don't even care right now. Oh, another option card. Thank you so much for the option card. I don't give a crap about. Thank you so much. Yay! Yay! Jesus. Well, if anything, those extra dizzy three PGs that I got, because I think I got like four of them. Uh, I can just use them for a carnival, I guess. Yay, 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 all the way to pity. This really sucks too, because, you know, I'm going to have a little over 7,000 rubies. And I really would like to get Ramlethal. Honestly, on my free-to-play account, you know, you do need a yellow defensive team and RHD past tier 40, and she is a yellow defensive character, and she's a damn good character to boot. You know, Starlight, Darkness, all the goodies. So I think what I'm going to do here is because we get summon tickets from the Saul bad guy, I'm just going to go ahead and wait. And I'll get that 3PG later, probably after I do my all my Saul runs, get those extra points. Then we'll come back in there and we'll try to get that. But we're going to go ahead and try to pull for Ramlethal and Dizzy here and see if we can get lucky. Why not, man? Why not? I really would like to get Ramlethal uh, badly. Dizzy's great, but she's an SS character. They're just hard to level up, especially on free-to-play accounts. 
So I don't get as excited for them. Even though they're awesome, I don't get as excited for them. I mean, the regular collaboration characters are always nice because, I mean, you can level them up no matter what. You know, you don't have to worry about a bunch of RNG, which is nice. And it looks like I'm going to get pretty screwed in this one here already. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I mean, now that I've started this, I'm probably going to try to go to that pity, do everything I can. We'll get some more summon tickets from the Soul Bad Guy event. Not bad. Not a... Oh, yay! Whip, whip, whip! You know, yay! A character that you'll never use. Well, a character that I'll probably never use. I like whip, but probably never use her. Don't really use the gold border too much. They're pretty much like fodder memories is all they are. Man, we're getting pretty screwed. We haven't got anything at all. Look at this, man. It's just yellow and blue, yellow and blue. Eh, I'm starting to get annoyed. I'm starting to get really annoyed right now. Usually with the free-to-play account, I hope for a little bit better luck. Please be Ramlethal. I mean, if it's Dizzy, that's great. You know, I already have her 3PG, but uh, I really kind of want Ramlethal, to be honest. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. Hmm. Who we got? Not bad. <laughs> Not bad. Got Dizzy. I mean, which is awesome. I mean, I can level up Dizzy uh, quite a bit if I really want to. The problem with Dizzy is, like, for the long term in the game, it's like she's going to be amazing for all the game modes for the most part, except for RHD. You don't need a blue balanced team in RHD at all. And that's kind of the thing that sucks about this character. Really, honestly, it's really about the only thing that sucks about that character. Everything else is pretty top tier. But I am happy that I got her. Because she is strong. Hmm. Oh boy, man. Ramlethal, Ramlethal. You're the one I want. Come on now, girl. Come on now, girl. I'm just going to skip it. Yay! Didn't get anything. Yay! And now we don't have enough rubies. And we need, what, 14? We need 80, 94 more pulls, which is, you know, a little less than 9,000 rubies. But we will get some more uh, pulls from the Soul Bad Guy event. So we're going to get some more rubies next week. We'll get some more rubies through this week. So, And I can get some more rubies through the story mode. So... I'm going to try to do my best to try to make it to this pity so I can at least try to get this girl right here because she really would be super beneficial for my account. But at least I got dizzy. And also today, we did end up getting this thing right here as well. Kind of scroll down here. Which is this right here, which is nice. Right? And then you're going to have to wait five more days, and then you can open it again, five more days, open it again, open it again, and so on, and so on, and so on. Which is kind of a bummer, because this banner is going to be gone by the time this thing finishes. But you will be able to get an SS memory from this thing, no matter what. So you can use it on any of the SS characters that you have available in the game. So it's still pretty damn awesome. So let me know how y'all doing in the game. Let me know, you know, what characters you've gotten, what cards you've gotten. And I do stream on Twitch at 9 p.m. GMT plus 7 time. The link is in the description below. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Y'all take care and have a good one. Good luck, everybody.